Tommy, my way of teaching someone how to do the Maddie flip. You're gonna wanna come through the object and then look up, stop, and make yourself come back to the object. And what you're doing is you're getting used to that backwards motion. And then all you're doing is once you get used to that backwards motion, all you're gonna do is link it together. And then once you get to here, you'll have a, an awareness of where that spot is where you just bring yourself back through. It's easy here because you can see the roof and you can see that pillar and you'll... Yeah, you've got a visual frame of reference. That's normally the hardest part when I've tried to do this on my own is like just got normal sky. And so this angle, and it's always going to be different depending on your camera angle, is what's most important. You got to find the angle that keeps your quad like this so that you're not going down or up, but rather just going in a backward motion. So let's load up a battery, fresh battery, and let's get this done. All right, here we go. Go through it. Then you're gonna stop and look back and tilt back before you get through it, almost. So you can still see, Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> so I was gonna say, so you can still see that pillar. Oh, uh, I, right? broke, I broke a prop already. Because what we gotta- The camera angle is a little lower, so I think- Oh, it's a lot lower. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. a lot lower. So what you gotta do is, what we're trying to do is you're trying to get that reference point of knowing this angle, and not dropping or changing up. Yeah. Instead of going through it like this and then trying to come back through it like this. Look at it. Look at it and just start that motion almost right where the pillar is. Yeah, there you go. So you want to get that flicky motion backwards, right? Okay, there you go. Okay, 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 it's clicking. It's clicking, right? So now, if you do the front flip over the pilot, or over the, the pillar, you should be able to find that spot. All right, here we go. Right now. Flip, flip, flip. Yep, find it. Come back, come back, come back. Oh, almost. <laughs> almost. I think I just went too high. So maybe let's start going through the pillar a little further. Right? Okay. There it is, there it is. You see it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look oh, at that. One more for good measure. Now, what you can do is you can <laughs> link that trick. You can link that trick with an inverted roll. And going and gapping through it backwards, right? That's right. Now okay. there's another one too. So go through the object now on the top. Okay. And do a backflip. What do you mean backflip? So you wanna you wanna go through the top with a little bit of speed, just kind of do a backflip and ha and hang there, inverted. Oh, okay. There you okay, go. okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, I got yeah, what you're yeah. Watch yourself. Oh, I knew it. Building. So when you invert, you can look backwards to, to, to find that pole, right? Oh, I see what you're saying. You know what I, what I mean? Saying. And then you're gonna find the pole once you're hanging upside down. So find the pole, find that pole. Yeah, there you go. There you go, that's that's it. So you're, you're kind of just spotting where you're gonna enter in reverse, right? <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm so stuck right now because normally when I do that, it doesn't, I'm, I'm normally down by now. And my quad's in one piece, bro. <laughs> now it's endless, and I think that it's gonna it's gonna give you a whole new dynamic to your flying. Oh no, absolutely! It's just like adding flavor to your recipe. What we want to prove here too is you don't need to fl to have 60 degree camera angle to fly that style, because look at Tommy's camera angle. 25. 25 degrees with a yeah. what, what kind of lens? Uh, just a GoPro lens, like a 2.5. But 2 .5. yeah, I mean, but you you bring up a very good point because I know that there's a lot of people out there that think you have to do the exact setup that he's got to do that trick. And they wonder how do they do it. People usually answer, well, "Oh, you got to fly the high tilt." It helps. It definitely helps. But you can figure out how to do it with with 25 degrees. It's all about knowing your gear. Spatial know, awareness. And knowing your craft. And, and yeah, and, and breaking down the trick into little steps. Like we watch you through it and we watch you back. We watch you through, we watch you back, and then we tied you in. Right. And then within, you know, a pack, you're doing inverts into gaps, you're doing the backflips into gaps, and and you're starting to see and visualize and and it becomes more of a dance now because you can use that dynamic. To, to move. Right, right, right. It's like it's like a core like foundational piece and once you've got that locked down now you can start tweaking it, put it on putting your own little swag and funk into it and now you get your style. <laughs> From one of the stylish guys in the game.